Hello guys, welcome to Joseph IT Technology Entertainer. Today I'm going to show you how to take your music, your audio tracks to your iPhone, your iPad or iPod easily with the help of iTunes. Basically, this process is not that easy. Apple wants its user to purchase music from Apple Store, but the way that I'm going to show you today will help you a lot, I think. Okay, if you are on Mac, then iTunes will be there, simply launch it. And if you are on Windows, then simply download the latest version of iTunes. And if you don't know how to do it on Windows 10, simply check the video from the description of mine. Okay, I'm now using the latest version of iTunes. And as you can see, my device is not yet connected here. So I'm on songs and I have some music files in my folder. There are 20 files. I'm just going to add it to songs. Okay. The songs are now added to songs. Now I'm going to connect my iPod to PC. Okay, as you can see that this device iPod has been connected. If I go there on the device, this iPod touch of 8 GB and make sure that manually manage music and videos are checked in okay you sh it should be checked and when it is checked simply click on apply and done okay now i can come back to songs the songs that you have select all and now drag this to your device and all the songs will be synced to your iPod or iPad or whatever device you are using right now. And I'm going to music of my device and the songs are now being synced as you can see. Okay, now it's finished. Okay, now if I want more songs to be added there, what I have to do, I just have to select more songs from there. Okay, and I'm dragging this to there. Okay, and what I'm going to do right now, simply control all to select all and then dragging these again from there to my device okay now the rest songs which i have selected later will be added to my list and it is being added okay as you can see it is finished now and in my device i can see that all the songs are there and easily i could take my music from my pc to my ipod to my i device okay and by this way you can simply take your songs there to your device and play it easily and i hope you really found this video useful if you have any question any query about this then please feel free to ask me on the comment box and i will try my level best to help you hope to see you in my next video tutorial until then goodbye